Yep. All right, for engine start, the first thing you want to look at is your IOAT before you close your canopy. Make sure that's below 80. In this case, that's a 47. We're good to go. Then you're going to say, pin box closed, rail clear. Is that what it says on the sheet? Pin box closed, rail clear. Here Visor down, pin box closed. Visor down, pin box closed, rail clear. There'll be a lever here to pull you, bring the canopy down, and then you'll close it and lock it. Make sure your canopy light. So close lash lights out. It'll respond with that to that. Uh, following that, you're going to do for lights. Camera in action, make sure I don't have a PMU, PMU status light. I'm going to turn on my anti collision nav lights at the cruise you know that I'm starting. Looking to get my start ready light down here in my CVUS panel. If I'm moving the PCL up slowly, there it is. Going to make sure I have it for three seconds. And it's good. So now I'm going to, I'm ready to start. Make sure I've got the voltage I need 23.6 and 2.1 minutes. IOT is good. So now I'm on call up here. It's going to be crew chief, fire bottle, no servicing. Start one. Still on. Ready to start. And crank. Crank you. you. Respond and you just give it a start. You look for your ignition, fuel flow, hydraulic pressure, oil pressure, and one's on the rise. ITT is coming on. Sir. First peak at 27, 647. Forty-seven. So we got a good start. Wait till we get to sixty percent M one here. There we go. Click, click, and bring the PCL back. Generator robot box fills what we should be looking at. Now you're gonna make sure if you add external power, you say hands clear, get that removed. But for the 